At Spaces TV, we are all about getting inspiration from great design and great designers. Today, we are getting a special tour of a showcase that's put on every year by the Hearst Design Group. But the great part is, is that with no clients, there's no demands, the designers actually get to express themselves, which is why this incredible experience is called Designer Visions. I am here at 250 West Street with the Veranda Apartment with the amazing Anthony Todd. Hi. How are you? Hi, okay. How are you? Good. <laughs> Thank you. So who is your dream client when you were envisioning this space? Well, being a downtown loft sort of apartment, I thought this would be the perfect home for a uh, you know, late 30s, early 40s chap who does something with money and a very glamorous young art collecting, loving wife and a teenage son. They have a passion for art. They obviously love to travel, so there's lots of things that, which remind them of their travel. The apartment still is young in its, in its sort of appointment and its point of view. So I noticed that there's different colors on the walls. Yep. What stylistically drove that decision? I love color blocking. Color blocking to me gives a lot of calm and peace in a room. It's moments of color rather than a plethora of color, rather than overdoing color. And again, back here with these monochromatic artworks with the, the monochromatic sofa with a little punch of color again brings it to life. I like it, the moments. The moments, yeah. Right, Lots I want, of moments. I want to see the moments. Can you show me around? <laughs> sure, let's go for a walk. Let's do it. So you also did the kitchen, and this is probably the coolest refrigerator I've ever seen in my entire life. It, it's awesome. It's so big. Again, it's seamless. You know, you've got this big kitchen in this in this room, and it becomes seamless. It becomes part of the room rather than not yeah. part of the room, which is quite smart. So it's a mix of the two, and, and it makes it more humble, I think, and homely rather than, you know, a kitchen. Fun. Study den. Love. Love no, it. I love this room. It's really private and really quiet. Lighting by a wonderful company, Troy Lighting. Okay. It's their collection and Irony's Objects again and Chuck Price and as I said, and Dedar Fabric. And it's a really cozy room in the house. It is. One of my favorite places to be. So here we are in the boys' bedroom. So why the accent wall? It's not a very big room, but to give it a, a big a burst of color and a life. There's that natural soft gray in the background everywhere throughout the apartment. This gives this young man's room a feeling of energy and a feeling of style. And then, yeah. you know, we, we balance it with this wonderful Dedar fabric on a Lee bed. And underneath it, this Merida handwoven jute carpet, which again keeps it young, yeah. keeps it vibrant, keeps it really friendly. It's definitely fresh. Yeah. So, question for you. Usually when you see accent walls, they're just stuck on one wall. Right. What is the purpose of extending it to this side as well? I think it makes for a calmer, balanced room. You know, you sort of walk in and you get that wonderful teal corner, but then you turn around and you have yeah. the monochromatic on that side, which softens it. So I think it's, it's stronger, it's warmer. So here we have the master bedroom, big room, and green at the end of the house. I love how it just, it like, kind of like takes you in, but there's not a ton of stuff. Yeah, it's a very roomy, airy space. And this room doesn't have so much color because, you know, I would think it's the most peaceful place to get away. It's, just, yeah. it's more monochromatic, beige, off-whites, grays, small touches of color. So when you're designing a monochrome bedroom, what are the things to keep in mind to keep it from being bland, but instead being beautiful? I would think make sure you include some beautiful shapes in there. You know, here there's this sort of rather wonderful mirror. There's mm -hmm. the, the console bulbous form lamps. I think as long as you keep some sculpture in the room, it keeps it warm and interesting. So if you were to say that there were like three key characteristics of Anthony Todd design that people could be inspired by, hmm. who is Anthony Todd? I would say the designs are friendly, compassionate, and there's that mix of modern and classic put together. And they're, they're moments of color without too much color, but just moments of color that bring it to life. I hope you guys are as inspired as I am definitely to bring some moments of color into your own home. Remember, there are two other designer apartments from Designer Visions. Definitely check them out on Spaces TV. Bye, guys. Love home and design? Make sure to subscribe to Spaces TV on YouTube.